You have a Razer keyboard and want to configure the RGB lighting you are in the right video. We will go to the Razer Synapse application, and once inside, we will go to the module section and select Chroma Studio. Here, you can see all the devices compatible with this software, such as my Razer Sonosa Chroma V2 keyboard and my mouse. Next, we will go to the bottom left corner and see all the effects. In this case, I will select the static effect. This effect means that if we select a color, it will remain fixed and not change. You will notice an eye-shaped symbol indicating whether the effect is active or inactive. Then, we will select the selector icon at the top and choose the entire keyboard, as if it were an image in paint. On the right side, a color palette will appear. For example, I will choose blue because it's my favorite color, and your keyboard will change color and remain static. The next effect is ambient awareness. Unlike the previous effect, it will change depending on the predominant color on your screen. For example, if you are watching a beautiful sunset, and the most predominant color is yellow, your keyboard will change to yellow. To adjust it, we will select the region of the screen to use to adjust the color. The next effect is called fire. On the right side, we will select the color in the warmth section. For example, I will choose red, and in the cool section, I will choose yellow. This effect will simulate the flames of a campfire, making you feel like you're on a camping trip or a romantic date with your partner. The next effect is starlight. We will select it, and then on the right, we will choose the gray color bar. Various color patterns will appear, and I will choose this pattern. Your keyboard will light up as if you were lying on the grass, looking up at the beautiful stars. The next effect is audio meter. This effect will change the color based on the type of song you play. We will select the gray color bar on the right, and I will choose the first pattern. When playing music, the brightness will increase in the bass and decrease in the treble, just like being at a rock concert. The next effect is wave. We will select it and then select the color. I will choose a two color pattern of purple and blue. As you can see, it creates a wave effect. If you want to know how to configure the following effects, check out the video I've provided. Click now and don't miss it.